Welcome to day two of our Pentecost Novena. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The words from our Foundress. The Apostles were elevated and almost carried away by the great heat of the divine strength. Not passion, but the divine fire that illuminated and sustained them, that made them understand the seven gifts, wisdom, which comprehends God, understanding, which penetrates the true faith, counsel, which guides wisely, fortitude, which makes persons fearless in working for God, knowledge, which enlightens in the way of God, different from the world's light, piety, a loving devotion toward God, and the last but first of all these is the fear of the Lord. And now we reflect. How often do I stop to consider the gifts God gives me at baptism and confirmation? The virtues of faith, hope, and charity, and the fruits and gifts of the Holy Spirit? Do I ask the Lord to increase these gifts? realizing that it is his desire to do so? Take some time today to reflect on the reality of these virtues, gifts, fruits within my soul and how they help me to live the call to holiness of life to which I have been called. Let us pray together the Novena Prayer. Come Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and enkindle in us the fire of your divine love. Send forth your spirit and all shall be created and you shall renew the face of the earth. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.